Five years have passed since bloody civil war was brought to an end in the Republic of Altus. Thousands of families remain displaced. Refugees scattered across countries around the Mediterranean. The CIA are becoming increasingly desperate. And AAF With the U.S.-led peacekeeping deployment coming to an end of its mandate, NATO forces... As millions of dollars in military equipment and infrastructure is decommissioned, opinion is split as to the wisdom of the drawdown. In light of CSAT forces stepping up joint military exercises in the Pacific. The U.S. is keen to reorient its conventional forces, reinforcing the Mediterranean the Basin representing a strategic fault line between crumbling European and... ...argue that the withdrawal could not come at a worse time. AAF forces begin to consolidate their position on the backing of Canton Protocol forces, equipment and training. Fire again Parliament was recalled for an urgent debate and a vote over the possible redeployment of British peacekeeping forces. Prime Minister Nicholas Ramsden said he would respect the defeat of his government's motion. Effectively ruled out the possibility of any extension to the NATO deployment in the former sovereign territory.
Thanks for flying. Please disembark in an orderly fashion. Gary, go check in with the lieutenant over there. He runs the show here at Rogaine. Lacey, I don't know. Make yourself useful for a change. I gotta piss. <laughs>